sorry about that. I had a phone call and I'm not sure how to pause it to take the phone call. So that tells you how kind of tech savvy I am. And I'm moving the, cam the camera or my phone around and I'm sorry it's moving. But anyways, so that, I'm gonna use that one as part one and this is going to be part two and because I do have quite a bit yet to show you, so. In that same, in the bath aisle there and everything where we kind of got rudely disconnected. <laughs> Anyways, I found some of the little bath bombs for the kids and I just thought these were too adorable. A uh, little Mickey and a little Minnie and then I did get a Paw Patrol one and I thought the kids would all love these, my littles, my little ones. So, and let's see, oh we might as well go into the other aisle that I love, that toy aisle. But this wasn't in the toy aisle. These were in the actual front of the store. These are the Pokemon um, trading cards. This one is the sword and the shield. And um, for a dollar, that's not a bad little buy. I have my um, oldest grandson that collects these. And then this is uh, the Pokemon uh, Unified Minds. I'm not real sure. I don't keep up with them. But I picked them up three, four or five packages. So... Uh, put in his little birthday card for him and I thought that was kind of cute. So I also found a new puzzle for my little friend Miss Elena. She's going to be working at home or no, she's not really at home. She is going to school this year. They're starting the 17th now. So but I thought just until then she can work on a little 48 piece puzzle. It's the Hatchimals and these are so cute for the kids. I, I love them. I, I you know, like I said, I, I'm a little kid at heart anyway, so. Another thing I did find for them, or for her to do, or, well, probably Dylan, because Dylan, I think, will enjoy this one. And that's a glow bracelet, and it's one kit, and you can make one of these little bracelets in here, and so I think she'll enjoy that, because she's been making the little bracelets and things, so Dylan Faith is getting this one. Oh, shh, don't tell her. <laughs> Let's see, okay. I did find a book, and this one is going to Dylan also. She is reading, and very, um, very good reader. So, uh, and her mom and dad really would like her to get a collection of books that are in her age group. And this one is really a, a kind of a neat one. It's called Among the Hidden, and it's for her age. It's um, ages of uh, eight to 12. So, and it is a child's, child's, not a child's book, but it's, it's a, uh, you know, like fourth, third, fourth, fifth, sixth graders. So, anyways, I found that at the Dollar Tree, and I think she'll get an enjoyment out of that if she would like to just pick up and read a little bit. This one is going to a gift, giving thanks, and it's the chicken soup for the soul. Love, love, like I said, I love the little chicken soup books, so cute, 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 and... They're nice, just little pick-me-up books that, you know, you want to read on something. And so I know somebody that needs this right now, and hopefully she'll enjoy that. Oh, I did forget down the aisle again here. I did find the little Bendy um, grab bag or blind bag. And I'm not sure what they are, but I do believe it's going to fit into the card for the for the grandson so it's in his age group because well it's like 14 plus and he's 12 so i believe it will be fine and let's see okay let's go down oh my hair care stuff i did find some a new scrunchie yes i did and isn't it pretty i bought two this one's going to one of my little girlfriends and this one's going to me because we like mermaids <laughs> We think we're mermaids when we're in the pool. So yeah, we are. Found another, I found some dollar t-shirts, you guys. I couldn't believe these. And these are for the little girls also. And these are youth, extra large, and that pink is adorable. And so I bought two. I hope they're fine. I checked them over really good. Um, sometimes you really have to look to make sure there's no little holes in them or anything or any of the seams and stuff are all, you know, taken care of. But these are perfect, and these are made by Glidden. So if you find your dollar t-shirts, look them over good because they're not bad. And so I found two in this pretty hot pink, and I believe they will, the girls will love them. Even if just to put on after swimming or just at night sleeping in them, 
however they'd like to do that. I found some socks. These are, um, I think they're boys. And they're like a dress sock. So I thought those were really, and they feel nice. They're nice and soft. So I thought they would fit me for this winter. And I did find some actual ladies socks like this. And there's three packages of, three pairs, I'm sorry, in here. And I love these. These feel like cotton almost. So, and I love, so I usually wear, these are my, kind of my go-to colors is navy and black. So I'll, um, I've got enough socks for the winter at least, hopefully. Uh, let's see, what else? Oh, for the girls again. Oh, sorry, I'm gonna need to reach in there. But I found these little shimmer bracelets. Haven't seen those at our, well, our Dollar Tree. So I thought, you know, they're cute. I got each one one and isn't that pretty? So I thought they'd get a kick out of those little bracelets. And let's see. I do have some pretties though. Let's start in that area. I found some more copper um, wire LED lights, the mini lights. I love these little lights and all you have to do is put a battery in there and you can twine them around anything. They uh, work in the little mason jars and they look so cute in those. And so these are, if I find them, I pick them up because for a dollar, you cannot beat that especially for crafts. I did find the little metal word signs and these are the actual harvest and thankful and welcome. And so I do believe I will be using a couple of these on um, some projects that I'm planning on doing here at the house. I found some more twine. This is jute twine and this is 300 feet. So I thought that was a pretty good buy and nice to have when you're doing um, projects and making things at home. I found a little sign. I love this sign. It's called Wild at Heart. And this is going to my oldest granddaughter because first off, these are her colors. And second off, I do believe she could be. She needs to remember to always watch and guard her heart. So that she does have a, a very good heart. So I thought that was so cute for her bedroom and decorating and stuff. I found some more paint. I don't know what I'm gonna do with all this paint, you guys, but I did find the actual purple that I'd like to use. So I am going to put that in with my Halloween crafts items and use that in the, um, on the wording, the, the wood letters and stuff. I found some more burlap um, ribbons and those are gonna be used um, and my wreathing, of course, I use, I'm going, I've actually found, I should show you the sign, but I'm making a puppy dog wreath. So these will go really cute with the little sign and, and all that. Hopefully I can get busy doing all that instead of going shopping at the Dollar Tree. I did find the, <laughs> I won't ever change that. That'll always happen. Did find the super glue and the gel. I am going to try that because sometimes that liquid gets all over everything and I wanna see how the gel works better. I found some batteries. These are the E-Circuit batteries and there is eight of them in there and these are the triple A's. So I did also find the double A's. So I picked those up also along with um, a nine volt. Found some pretty little pumpkins. These are, of course, going in with the pumpkin stash that I have already to work in threes. So, of course, that'll get done one day, hopefully soon. So, that is something I am trying to get together. Um, we have a trip planned at the end of the month, and we have some, some family coming in. And so, I'm going to be very busy. So, I really am excited about it, though, because we needed to see some people and, and visit and enjoy time with people. I found some picks. I did pick up four of these little picks, and uh, I like them because they got the little white pumpkin. And I want to try them in one of the little pumpkin wreaths holders, which I have not been able to find, by the way. Excuse me, I'm going to be moving over some more of my stuff. Oh, and I dropped you. I'm so sorry. Here we go. Here you are. I hope you enjoyed your trip. I don't even know how to edit that out. I'm so sorry. Okay, I knew better. I should have said something there on it. Okay, I'm sorry. Okay, 
What else can happen? Oh well, found some bags. Cute little bags. Do small things with great love. I love this one and I will be using that for probably to put my paints in or maybe right now when I travel um, at the end of the month, I might use it for my cosmetics and my hair care products and all that. I found a couple more bags since we're on the bags aisle and I, I do love these because you never know when you're going to need them. These are the little tote bags and I love these colors, the pink and then of course the pink on the side. So I thought those would really work well for when I do need them for blow dryers and all the fun things that you pack when you leave. So when you, when you go somewhere. So I like those two colors the best. I thought those were the prettiest. Uh, and they're hard to find sometimes at our stores. We don't get it at the tote bags. We don't get that at the tote bags as much. Uh, but anyways, I got those. I did pick up a gift bag because I have a gift that I am getting ready. And I thought that was so pretty. It's just a it's just a little happy. So I thought I would put it in this little happy gift bag. So and let's see i did find one of the large um picture frames i haven't seen a, these at our dollar tree either so i did pick up one of these because i have a calendar that i want to start using taking out and making pictures out of the chick on the chick on the cheap i think it is anyway she showed said that these work perfect for the calendar pictures so all you have to do is cut the picture off and take it apart, put the picture in here, and wham, you got yourself a nice picture. Which, like for, you could change it out for fall, you could change it out for Christmas, you could change it out for every season, and for $2, you have a nice picture, really, if you buy one of the dollar calendars over at the Dollar Tree, which I have, and I do, I have them somewhere, I don't know where, but anyways i did find these also these are so pretty and i am giving one away and one is going to me <laughs> but um i am going to set it up in my little fall um shelf and i not shelf i have a table that i'm going to decorate these with so but this one is going to uh sister marsh with a really nice candle in there so but i've seen them lit and they shine right through. They've got the mercury glass, and it is so pretty. It, I mean, it just, look at that. For a dollar, I mean, this is a nice, nice fall collection right here. So, fall piece to have. So I did pick those two up. Oh, let's see, I did, oh, in the craft aisle still, I picked up the black, I'm gonna paint this black, black cat with a pumpkin, so. And I picked up some more of this jute mesh or mesh tube that looks like jute, I should say. Um, I'm so happy to have found it. Our store has only been having the actual colors, and these are going to work perfect in the fall wreaths. And so I'm excited about that. Uh, some more of the picks. Here you go. I, I love these. I love them with the with the white pumpkin. It just looks so pretty. I did pick up. A couple of the little pick, the other color picks with the, the sunflowers, of course. So, so yeah, I'm getting together to do all my stuff, and one day I will have it all together. I um, I did find some more um, coloring books. These were just adorable. These are actually um, the designer series. They're the butterflies. I don't know if you can see with the, the glare, but they're very pretty. And then I did get this one. It's the Water World coloring book. And it is, again, with the Designer Series. And then I did get this one, again, the Designer Series Creative Creatures to color. So I thought those were really cute. And here again, places to color. So you got your places even now. So those are going in my gift bag to my assisted living 
uh, people. Actually, I, I've got a nice little bag for to get going to them, so I will get them going. Um, I did find, got to pick this one up. I don't know why I enjoyed that so much other than the fact that it's just, it is it is autumn, you know, and falling leaves and pumpkin pie and happy fall, hot apple cider and um, family and friends. So I do have something in mind for this. So I will um, hopefully get to share it with you when I get it done. I found these. I love these. These are so nice, these envelopes. And you get two of them. And so I thought, you know what, um, a lot of people, we have a lot of like some um, important papers that you want to store, perfect. So I've already picked up a couple more of those and I thought, why not? And I found these and I was so excited. I couldn't believe it. I seen Thrifty Tiffany haul them and she's over in Georgia. So I thought, oh, maybe we'll get them, maybe we'll get them. And we did. We got the little fashion masks. Aren't these cute? These are adorable for a dollar. And these are the adult size. And I just couldn't resist. I couldn't resist. So I picked up three. And then I picked up the children's size. I got a unicorn one. Isn't that just cute? And then I got a little, I think it's a mermaid, a kitty mermaid. I think. Does that look like a little kitty corn or yeah, something, but yeah, isn't she cute? So I picked up two, one for my granddaughter and one for Elena. So I just, I couldn't believe it for a dollar. These masks, I, I need to try one on. Let's try one on and see how they work because they, I, I couldn't, couldn't stand it. I'm going to actually try on the one that, okay, let's try them on. Why not? Let's open them up. They come in these nice little resealable bags too. So you can actually put them, once it's clean, put it back in the bag and throw it in the car. They are just one little piece. Oh, don't mind us. Somebody's at the door, somebody's walking by. Oh, shh, 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 shh. Hey guys, I love the daisy print on here. Hey, hey guys. Oh my goodness. These are just cute for a dollar. I couldn't believe it. Yeah, at the Dollar Tree. Wow. I know. My dad's like, wow, that's a good buy. It is. Yeah, and they don't hurt your ears, and you can breathe out of them. Go run to the Dollar Tree and pick up some masks. I have a funny feeling we're going to have to wear them for quite a while yet. So, and I found, of course, at the same, right there by the masks, hand sanitizer and they did have the larger ones there and this is the first time I have seen this since before I'd say March the pandemic started so these are eight fluid ounces for a dollar so if you can you guys check your dollar trees because they're coming back with the hand sanitizer they did let us get four so I did and let's see what else is out there I don't know I think I've got most of my stuff out here, you guys. I've uh, I've shared and shared it all. So I hope you enjoyed my second half of this and my first half and flipping over and having a good time. So anyways, it's uh, Wednesday afternoon. It's kind of cloudy here and we might be getting a little storm later. I'm not sure. It looks pretty much like a good storm. Uh, we did cool down a little bit though. We were in the upper 90s and with the heat index in the hundreds and now we're down into the 80s with a heat index into the 90s. So, but anyways, you guys all have a good afternoon mm -hmm. and take good care and hopefully I'll see you again with another Dollar Tree haul. God bless you all.